2008 Olympic team was a veteran team of amazing talent and experience. Right now, we still have that 2008 team in our pool of players for these four years, but they're not gonna participate. Therefore, it gives a younger group an opportunity to show what they can do with uh, USA Basketball with a few veterans sprinkled in. In the past, uh, teams were selected, all-star teams were selected with a week or a week and a half of practice and they just threw them out there and that was good enough to play internationally. That's not the case anymore. I mean, that's not the way other countries do it. Other countries have the continuity of having a culture, playing together, of knowing what to expect from one another. And so one of our first goals when he chose me as the head coach and we chose the staff was to win but understand who we were representing and how we could uh, create an environment that's conducive to success. The young players we have now with this new, new team we're putting together, they know it's a privilege to represent their country, but they are young. So it's going to be challenging for us as we go forward in the worlds because uh, the world will be ready for us. I, th I don't think it's rebuilding. I think it's much more uh, continuation of what USA Basketball is trying to do. Tough decisions for us uh, going forward, but uh, the plan is to bring 15 players to uh, to New York, and uh, we advise everyone that we'll be making those decisions uh, over the next 24 to 36 hours, and players will be advised on Monday uh, at the latest. The USA team is, uh, you know, we're going to be a team that's a blue-collar team that's going to come out and work hard, you know, and play hard every possession.